Hello everyone. Happy Thursday. Uh, hope you all are having a, a good week coming off of Holy Week. Um, it's my favorite time of the year. Uh, this last week was um, reflecting on the work of, of Jesus Christ uh, coming to to die on a cross for us. Um, not only we do we reflect on uh, what he did for us, but uh, it forces us to reflect on why he had to do it. Uh, the fact that we needed the Savior because we are broken people, and we can't do, we can't save ourselves. Um, it's just it's a wonderful time of year. I'm very grateful to have spent it here in uh, in Ashland at Trinity. Um, I hope you all had a a good Easter. Um, spent some time with some family, whether in person or just got to talk to them. Uh, I know I did. I got to talk with my family back in California for a while. And that was awesome. Um, would you please uh, join me in prayer? Um, Heavenly Father, we thank you for uh, this time of year where we can reflect on, um, on our condition as human beings. Um, that cannot save ourselves. We are sinful, Lord. Uh, we, we do not. We do not follow your law perfectly. We do not uh, love our neighbors as ourselves, and we justly deserve your temporal and eternal punishment. But uh, but there is a but, and the but is that uh, Jesus Christ, your Son, uh, came down to save us, to live and to die in our stead, and God. Um, we thank you so much for that, uh, for, for the joy of our salvation, of your salvation. Um, and so, God, I, I pray that as we, ca as we close out our week, uh, that, that those words, he is risen, he is risen indeed, alleluia, would continually ring in our ears uh, and guide our steps as we, as we close out this week, Lord. Um, there are people that uh, all of us need to be reminded of those words daily um, that he is risen and this is cause to for celebration it's cause for um, for action uh, to, to move us to live out our faith God we ask that that you would move us to live out our faith uh, today um, with wherever you have us um, whether it's a, alone or with people, with co-workers, with family, um, with people that we don't even know. God, we ask that you would be with us and nurture our faith uh, to further your kingdom. Because uh, that is the greatest thing that, that we are capable of doing as new creatures, as new men and women born in the Holy Spirit. We ask that you would bring this to us. Um, and Lord, there are, are still a lot of people uh, in the midst of this great season of the church. There are still a lot of people that are hurting and suffering. God, um, I have a friend that uh, is out in Colorado right now just going through a really tough time. And uh, it's just a reminder that good intentions, um, faithful people, we still suffer. Suffering is a part of our lives part of the world um, so God we, we we pray for ourselves and any other people that we have on our hearts today this morning um, that need your help that need their faith uh, renewed and strengthened so that they can cling to you for their assurance and uh, for their security as as they go throughout their day which may be very uh, unsecure and, and scary. God, um, we pray for those people. Um, I would like to pray for the pastors that we know. Uh, pastor Kevin McLean, uh, faithful pastor, and all the other faithful pastors, God, that you would keep bolstering them to provide the good things that you have in store for your people. We need them, Lord. We need them to be continually strong um, for they sacrifice a lot for us. 
And sometimes we're not always aware of it or grateful for it. But God, today we pray, we lift them up and ask that you would, that you would provide to them the same thing that you provide to us. Um, that strength and faith um, and your promises for us. So God, we, we pray for these things today um, with, the, with the hope and comfort that you will hear us and that you will answer us. Um, please bless this day and uh, give us, uh, keep us walking in the joy of, of your Son, your risen Son. In Jesus' name, amen. You all have a blessed day. Um, go out in peace, for he is risen, uh, and I will see you next week.